What's up guys, welcome back to the channel. Today I'm talking about Satama and some of the latest updates we've seen within this cryptocurrency. As you guys know on this channel, I try and bring you guys all of the latest information as fast as I physically can. Uh, and all of the things that we're seeing, updates from the developers, from Rust, updates from Elon Mansur as well guys. I just want to tell you guys some of the things that we've seen that is going to host, hopefully kind of give you a guide of how we can now reach our all-time high gain and really kind of grow from here. Because a lot of people are wondering, what is what is going on guys like are we going to actually realistically be able to recover and what's the long-term plan for satama now before we get any further guys i just want to say i know a lot of you guys want to see all the main details so i'm going to show you all that in this video i'm going to jump straight over to the screen now so you guys can see it uh, and just let's get straight into this guys it's very very important so the current price is 0 0.00000001727 now obviously the biggest question is are we going to be able to get back into those twos a lot of things have happened recently uh obviously you guys i'm sure are aware of the usc announcement so we're going to be sponsoring obviously islam there on the fight which is awesome we're going to be showing us satama logos all over the kit as well whilst fighting again another big massive thing for satama which i'm going to get into in a minute guys and talk about more about that and more about what else we've seen right but the big question is is are we going to be able to get into those twos back into the freeze now what we've seen today guys is i'm going to cover is something which is kind of a specific plan which kind of really in details tells exactly how we're going to get back up to that all-time high and recover bigger and better than we have before. Now, before we go any further, guys, I just want to say I'm not a financial advisor. This is purely my own thoughts and opinions, and it's for entertainment purposes, okay? Because, again, a lot of people will have different opinions on this, whether or not we can do this. But, again, I just want to clearly clarify that this is what I think may happen, guys, in the future. So it's very easy to look at the timer right now and kind of say, well, look, you know, we've, we've was up high, now we're at kind of a low point. It's very easy to just kind of feather on that too. But reality is about this situation is this, is we grew to where we currently are, or was at all one time, purely off of hype and kind of, you know, just growth, guys. There was no major kind of foundation underlying of Satama. Nothing really kind of to have like a structure. It was just literally growing because the Satama name was growing. Which is good, but obviously we knew, we knew without a solid foundation holding the bases up, it's like building a skyscraper. If you build a skyscraper with no solid foundation, it's going to fall over. You're going to have these winds come along and blow it across and have to start a game. And Satama's so learned that and they've obviously got a full plan of how we're going to manage to recover. And I'm sure you guys are all fully aware of obviously what that is too. Uh, this tweet here... Uh, really kind of covers it and Russ has retweeted this because this is literally and I've been saying exactly this in my videos for the last couple of months guys uh, but I'm going to read it to you anyway because this is exactly the step-by-step -step detail of how we are going to recover back to our all-time high and big shout out to obviously Upside Vision here for tweeting this big shout out to Upside Vision obviously for doing this um, for tweeting this out and writing this in a step-by-step -step tutorial because it really does help so step one SATA mask is going to SATA swap feature will be enabled in a few days three to seven days Conservatively speaking, let's say February 22nd. Okay, we know hopefully the swapping feature is going to be re enabled back before the end of February. Step two, approximately one week after, SATA Reality will be launched into the SATA Wolfpack. So the new token will obviously be released pretty much a week out or two after that the swapping feature is back. Now, keep in mind, Russ has retweeted this and saying that this is kind of the hopefully going to be the plan. Step three, a combination of the two catalysts will drive critical investors to gain more confidence in Satama and to start FOMO in. Considering the low entry point right now, it's very appealing, which is also very true. You know, it's going to be a lot of FOMO going around and we're at a very low point to buy in. Step four, Islam UFC fight on February 26th will display Satama to the world, inciting new investors to buy in and start using Satamas app for the first time. So that fight is going to really kind of give new investors an opportunity to jump in here. And again, if you guys have watched my videos in the last couple of weeks, I've been saying this exactly, obviously not the UFC part, but the whole kind of growth element of this is how we're going to, uh, growth once the swapping feature is turned back on. Step five, institutional investors will consider Satama as a great long-term investment opportunity after analyzing Satama and seeing it fully functional. Uh, obviously, as you guys know, uh, once the SATA mask, uh, is, SATA mask is fully functional, including the swapping feature and everything as well, the NFT project rolls out, we see the new token launch, everything is working properly. Uh, that's when we're most likely then to see, obviously, uh, exchanges and the bigger companies coming in. Because we know that's not going to happen until the app is 100% fully working, okay? Step six, in mid-March, the Dubai Expo will solidify all business relationships further and build a great exposure for the Satama ecosystem. And step seven, ma major tier exchanges will witness the high trading volumes and start this in Satama, which will drive the past price to all-time high. Now, again, it's very easy to look at this and say, well, that's not going to happen. And that's what a lot of people do. They look at it and say, 
no, this is not going to happen. That's fine if people think that, but I do generally agree with this, okay? Because obviously we've got the token, we've got the hyper burn then coming in too from all the tokens. And this is realistically the, the growth pattern that will happen for Satama. And again, I do believe it. And again, it's just my thoughts. It's other people's thoughts too. A lot of people obviously seem to agree with that too. Uh, and it's, like I said, it's very easy to look at Satama right now and say, well, it's at 1719. Like, how are we going to get back up to that point we was at? Again, it's very possible. If we were there once without any solid foundation, just imagine once the foundation is fully working. We were at a point so high, okay, that we had nothing under us. Of course, we can get past that and way above it with actual foundations in place. Now, yes, of course, I'm not here to try and, you know, ignore the, the, the errors we've seen along the way. Of course, there have been some errors along the way which have not been good. You know, I'm here on this YouTube channel to try and give you guys a non-biased opinion as well. I'm trying to just share with you what we've seen. And of course, when these things happen, uh, it's not good. And I, I try and cover the ups, the downs, the lows, the highs, just so it's full, fully fair for everybody who's looking to have a full review, obviously, this time. And again, just to clarify, you know, I'm not sponsored or endorsed or anything by these cryptocurrencies, guys. Uh, I've never been uh, sponsored by Satama in any way, shape or form. I've just purely given my own thoughts in every single video. And that plan we've just read is exactly what I think will happen for Satama in the near future. But yeah, guys, that's pretty much all the latest information, a step-by-step -step tutorial of how we're going to recover from Satama to get us back up to that all-time high. Again, just my thoughts, just other people's thoughts. If you don't believe this as well, guys, that's entirely up to you. I know a lot of you guys want to see more of these videos where I just make sh less videos, but more in-depth detail ones. And I'm going to start working on that. I know sometimes I post three or four or five videos a day covering all different topics. I think maybe it might be easier for me, guys, for you, for me just to cover all of them if I can in kind of one or two. It's just you guys are not always watching five or six videos. Uh, again, I do apologize if I've done that. But again, guys, I'm just trying to show you guys all the information as fast as I can. And I hope you guys appreciate that. I am trying my hardest here to keep up to date with it. And again, a lot of people aren't going to like it. Some people want the, the four or five videos. Some people want the one too. Some people want none, you know. It, you can't please everyone. But I'm going to stop putting my face more on this. Uh, get involved more, talk to the wolf pack, uh, tell you guys my thoughts and try and share with you all the information. So if you did enjoy this video, subscribe to the channel. Uh, go, by the way, guys, I've just joined Twitter. So if you want to follow me on Twitter, my Twitter is JamieTechYT. So Jamie Tech on my YouTube, then YT standing for YouTube. Uh, I put it on the screen now if you guys want to follow me. really would appreciate that as well, guys. Uh, I can share all my thoughts on there as well in more detail additional to these videos. So that's it for this video, guys. If you did enjoy it, subscribe, turn on post notifications, and I'll see you guys in the next